Today's story is about Baby Unicorn 10 Minutes to Bed Baby Unicorn written by Rhiannon Fielding and Chris Chatterton. In a forest that only a special few know, where sugar, sun sparkles and moonflowers grow, everything glittered with happiness, only Twinkle the Unicorn felt a bit lonely. She longed for a brother or sister to raise, someone to gallop with someone to chase. Ten minutes to bed, Twinkle thought with a sigh, as two baby dragons flew low through the sky. Determined she trotted as fast as she could, and she followed a stream to the edge of the wood. Nine minutes she flicked her small tail with a swish, then closed her eyes tightly and started to wish. Above the young unicorn something grew bright, a magical rainbow that arched through the night. Eight minutes to bed, Twinkle opened her eyes and on the end of the rainbow was close to her feet. And there, zooming down it, so fluffy and sweet, was a unicorn baby, his eyes open wide. Seven minutes, she plopped off the end of the slide. A note fluttered down with a whoosh and a whiz. Twinkle read it, then looked at her new brother Fizz. Six minutes to bed. Fizz was tinkling her toes. Gently she sniffled him and nudged with her nose. Slowly but surely he stood by her side. Come on, Twinkle told him, there's no need to hide. Five minutes the rainbow grew pale in the sky, but as it got fainter Fizz started to cry. Don't worry, said Twinkle, and gave him a smile. Then she pulled silly faces and jumped for a while. Four minutes to bed, there was still time to play and plenty to make fist tears go away. The littlest unicorn leaped over the logs. He swam in a stream. He loved chasing frogs. Three minutes to bed. This was not what she'd planned. Her brother was covered in pink sugar sand. Just then from the trees came a fluttering sound and hundreds of lights shone like stars all around. Two minutes to bedtime, Fizz gurgled with joy as the fairies all danced round the new baby boy. The forest was doubled with moonlight and shade as the unicorns entered a mossy green glade. One minute they ran with their legs in a muddle straight towards dad for a big family cuddle.